Hello! Welcome to my channel if you're new, or welcome back if you're not. Now, I bet you don't have a clue what I'm doing, what I'm going to react to, do you? Uh, not for the obvious fact, it's right in front of my screen. Also, it's on the thumbnail, so... But other than that, you don't have a clue, do you? Yeah, I thought so. Anyway, let me enlighten you. I don't know why I'm speaking like this. Uh, but yeah. Uh, I am doing uh, Dreamcatcher's uh, Relay Dance, which, uh, to the, well, today I, I already did, uh, uh, <laughs> I can't speak. I went out for a walk, and then I'm exa absolutely exhausted, so, and I've just come back, you know, I sat down, made, made a brew, and um, tried to speak English. So, anyway, as I was saying, I've done XG's uh, Relay Dance, and, um, fantastic. So I thought, you know what, Dreamcatcher actually uh, the goddess when it comes to relay dances. Now, um, not only are the, the fact they're my favourite girl group in general, you know, uh, but also they are actually, um, I think they have a lot of relay dances and I couldn't choose. So I just chose three random ones. Uh, I'm sorry if you, you know, if you don't like the music or you don't like Dreamcatcher, but... Um, yeah, I don't know where I'm going with this, so just just go along, just go along with it, you know, just just free free with it, yes, free, yes. Yeah. Oh. Anyway, let's get to the reaction before I, I I'll give up babbling. I give up. I give up. Vision. Um. Yeah. Sorry. This is Dreamcatcher's um, vision uh, relay dance. They kind of uh, dropped the ball in this one. This move, normally in the video, uh, where they do like, where Handong singing and then they're doing the like the clock hands, it's normally nicely synchronized in the video. Uh, not so on this one. See? <laughs> it's like, it's like, it's like, ask her, we just give up to do it. <laughs> they, have, they have some comedy, you know, they are like a comedy group as well. That's why I love the Dreamcatcher. Now, and they they don't seem they they're not even uh, attempting to dance here. By the way, I, this is just for fun, but they're just uh, enjoying themselves, just relaxing during this. Because in the actual MV, the real choreography, uh, they uh, they do hard choreography. Um, at the moment, they're just kind of like relaxing. I think um, they do these relay dances maybe just before or after they actually do the MV. That's why they've got the same same uh, suit, same clothes on. As they do when the MV. Yeah, yeah. Uh. Sorry, she's a goddess of rock. Um, rock, <laughs> yeah, goddess of rap. Uh, for me, in my opinion, don't hate me. I know a lot of people will disagree, but in my opinion, she's one amazing rapper, number one for me. Yeah. 
that was see do you see that that was different that one was a little different the first time they go like a, a clock like a spiral kind of thing and this one was just like a statue but it's weird see it's good it's good Actually, no, I, I think I might have seen this a while ago. This is a song. Uh, this song's like a year ago. Well, this um, relay dance. But I've never, I've never noticed. I've never paid attention until now the, how they're dancing properly. And they're just a comedy group. That's what they are. They're just comedians. And um, don't take, don't, just because you watch this, for people that don't know Dreamcatcher, if you watch this and you think this is what they're like uh, on stage and whatnot, no, 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 no. They're actually one of the best, um, and they do the hard, one of the hardest uh, choreographies on stage. And I'll, um, I'll show one video, maybe today, later today or tomorrow, that I've never seen anyone else do uh, this kind of choreography. And they're very unique, and it's very, it looks very difficult to pull off. Even when there's seven of them, it looks difficult to pull off. I'll show you later which song it is and which dance it is. Uh, for those that are uh, not new to Dreamcatcher, that knows Dreamcatcher, you'll know which one I'm on about. So, anyway, I like to. They're just they're so funny. Next one is Bon Voyage. Now, uh, this was part of a trilogy: Bon Voyage, Vision, and the first one was Maisel. Now, in Maisel. Um, after seven years, they actually won the first uh, award, first major award when it comes to South Korea. And the amount of happiness Insomnia had, Dreamcatcher had, this stuff, everyone was crying, crying with the happiness, and especially Dreamcatcher. Now, I remember watching this, and Dreamcatcher... They burst out crying for the first award after seven years of hard work, dedication, and support, you know, and love and support from Insomniers, which uh, well, that's us, Insomniers, her fan, their fandom. And they're bursting out crying. And when they received the award, they couldn't speak. No one could speak. They were just too busy crying. And uh, normally at the end of that certain award, uh, you're supposed to sing um, a part of the actual song you were, uh, you know, you won for, you won the award for. However, when they started to sing, they couldn't, it was so, so, it was so funny, but yet emotional at the same time. They were trying to sing, but they just kept crying and crying while they were singing. And it was just hilarious to watch. <laughs> it was hilarious to watch, but then again, it was a well-deserved win after so many years. And then they won again for Bon Voyage. So Vision, unfortunately, it didn't, I don't think it got a win. I'm not sure. Then they won two from Bon Voyage soon afterwards. Um, that's it. So that kind of uh, shows that Dreamcatcher loved 
you know, after all, in uh, South Korea, because a lot of people say they're not. They've kind of like mostly uh, based for international fans due to the fact uh, South Korea uh, mainstream music isn't rock, but yet insomnia is all over the world. Love them. So anyway, let's get on. I love I love um Xion's uh, look on this one. Her dress, her hair, everything. She looks you know, there's one thing with Dreamcatcher for me, it's difficult for me to pick a bias because I love them all. And generally I love them all. The each girl is unique and they have their own quirks and they have their own talents, they have their own you know, it's charisma. It's it's very difficult to pick a bias properly. I keep bouncing from Yuyan to Xion to uh, even Sua, Injiu, and Handong. I keep bouncing between all, pretty much all of them. All of them, you know, uh, Dami and uh, Gaion. But it's hard to pick an actual bias. So for those who's got your biases in Dreamcatcher, well done. I envy you because I can't choose. <laughs> Oh, it's wonderful. For um, obviously people who understand sign language, that was it. That's sign language. Sign language for I love you. Fantastic. Sua, Sua, what are you doing, Sua? Sua being naughty. Nothing new there, actually. I know you, I know wow. You. Wow, Sua there. <laughs> what did what did she what did the shares come from? This is what I'm saying with Dreamcatcher. They they don't take anything seriously. It's just funny. They just do you know quirky stuff like this, and I love them. Good. That was hang on. Oh, that was pretty good actually. I like the hand movement, hand gestures. Uh, that's cool. Ha <laughs> ha 
She's so she's so fourth dimensional. She's so fourth dimensional and so extra. <laughs> Oh, sewer, sewer. Oh, the me, you know, uh, they always make me laugh, even uh, on relay dances. Oh my god, you know, I um. This, I blame uh, a certain creator for making them uh, become all one that I couldn't pick bias. So you know who you are, and uh, shout out to Insomnixie. She makes a great, great context when it comes to dream catchers and dream catcher. And um, it's so funny. That's why it's hard to pick a bias because she makes really good content on each uh, member individually. But and then, then you like, you watch them all, and you think, oh, who can I choose as my bias now? Who's my bias? Who's my bias wrecker? It is so difficult. So that's for me in my case. Anyway, <clears throat> we'll do something completely 180. <laughs> so, Dreamcatcher Relay Dance for a cover. Now, cover is called Abracadabra. And it was originally sung by another K-pop girl group, uh, Brown Eyed Girls. Now, the other two was more comical. This one is going to be a little bit less comical and a bit sexier. But the, it will be a little comical, but more sexier. Now, um, Dreamcatcher has done some... Co uh, they do covers. The Queen of Covers. That's what they are, Dreamcatcher. They're the Queen of Covers. And they do some really sensual uh, covers as well. And, and wow, my jaw dropped on one of them. Um, I'm not going to tell you which one until I could do a reaction on it. So, oh, you probably know which one anyway. So, this is one of them. <laughs> that's cool. See, now that's what I mean. This is this one's cool. Sync to the arm movements. Right, wait, 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 wait. There we go. Come on, movements. Oh, you, you know what you're doing? <laughs> you, 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 just goes a step further, don't you? She just couldn't resist not making us, uh, well for her, my god. A hard traffic is I, I'm not simping, shush. I'm not. Honestly, I'm not.
What I love about this cover as well, um, which I've not noticed on the others. Yeah, I have. Yeah. They kind of like change colours a lot in this one. And uh, I love it. I love this song. <laughs> Colors as in like the lighting effects. Um, kids, can you please uh, turn away for a few minutes? This is I was trying to keep this uh, PG, but it's not working. It's not working, and it doesn't, it doesn't help the fact that I keep rewinding it and watching it again. Gee, come on, you can't you can't do that gesture. You can't do that gesture and not give us heart attacks in the process. Seriously, come on. I mean I mean come come, come my heart. <laughs> Sorry. That dance, that is sensual that dance. Oh wow. See, now, <clears throat> a lot of people, that could be a culture shock. <laughs> For us in the West, May, not as much, but for those in South Korea, there must be, uh, well, in Korea, there must be um, kind of shocked when I first saw that, so, especially Abracadabra. Um, very nice girls did it first, but oh, that, was, uh, oh, that was a little bit hot. I'm not going to lie, it's a bit hot. It's minus one degrees here, but yes, it's a little bit too hot. Ah, that's what Dreamcatcher does to you. Okay, so that was um, my three Dreamcatcher Relay Dance covers. No, a Relay Dance, sorry. The first two was the Relay Dance, so this one was a Relay Dance cover, uh, Abracadabra. So uh, until uh, the next time, thank you for watching, and uh, see you on the next reaction for now. Bye.
Thank you.